Hi there, and welcome to Cinema Nerds, the podcast. My name is Mike Turkus, and I am the editor-in-chief of CinemaNerds.com, your destination for everything movies. At Cinema Nerds, we have coverage of movie news, trailers, reviews, as well as the occasional interview. Every week on this podcast, we will be offering our views on the latest film releases, such as our topic today. While you may not remember when the stature of Nicolas Cage and his acting ability became the stuff of legend, rest assured, it did. And Tom Gormican's film, The Unbearable Weight of Massive Talent, sets out to ensure that everyone recognizes how utterly fantastic Mr. Cage really is. What's the worry here, Nick? You've lost some of your talent as an actor? No. <laughs> what did he say? He says he loves you, but he went in a different direction. I'm done. I'm quitting acting. Ah, oh, man, I'm driving through the hills. I'm sorry. One more time. We got another offer. It's a million bucks. It's to attend a wealthy gentleman's birthday party. The guy that owns this house, what's his name? Javi. Javi. Mr. Cage. Excuse me. Is Javi going to want me to, uh, you know? I'm not sure I understand. Look, it's Javi. I am Javi. The film follows actor Nicolas Cage as, facing an uncertain financial future and dwindling acting prospects, he is forced to accept a rather lucrative offer to appear at the birthday party of a wealthy fan played by Pedro Pascal. Intending to retire after the party appearance rids him of his debts, Cage finds himself recruited by CIA agents, played by Tiffany Haddish and Ike Barinholtz, to provide intelligence on this super fan, whom they believe to be a notorious drug smuggler. I'm in position. I think that's the actor Nick Cage. Nick Cage? I love you. Have you seen Croods 2? I'm 44 years old. Why would I see Croods 2? I've seen Face Off and Con Air. What do you guys want? We're with Central Intelligence. Do you know who you're spending time with? One of the most ruthless men on the face of this planet. I need you to help the U.S. government. As is the case in Hollywood, nothing is as it initially appears in this film. It is a continually involving storyline that boasts enough twists and turns and surprises to please and win over even the most ardent of skeptics. In some ways, the film plays as a less heady but still clever and creative version of being John Malkovich from 1999, and it is often just as rewarding as that similarly heady film proved to be. You can't quit acting, you can't! That's none of your business. Whether you like it or not, you have a gift. And that gift brings light and joy to an increasingly dark and broken world. And to turn your back on that gift is to turn your back on the en entire human race. Director Tom Gormican, who co-wrote the script with Kevin Eaton, finally delivers on the initial promise of his 2014 film, That Awkward Moment, with a triumphant return to feature directing after a lengthy tour producing a variety of television programs, including serving as executive producer of Ghosted from 2017 to 2018. There is a reverence present for the persona of Nicolas Cage, to be sure, but the actor is so in on the fun that it is hard not to get caught up in that exuberance as well. That's our episode for this week. Thanks for listening, and don't forget to visit Cinema Nerds on Facebook and Twitter and at our website at cinemanerds.com.